Check out this Dolly Parton song. <laughs> Actually, Dolly Parton covered that song on her variety show later in the 70s, but of course that's China Girl by the Doobie Brothers. The other day I was watching their, uh, their new concert, uh, World Gone Crazy Tour concert. Uh, saw these guys a couple years back in uh, just, uh, just north of Seattle at a really nice intimate concert. Uh, one of my favorite bands from the 70s, the Doobie Brothers. Uh, China Grove is a song written about a t an actual town in Texas, China Grove. But unlike the song portrays it, it really isn't um, a Chinatown, uh, a Texas Chinatown. It's, it's, uh, it's not like that at all. There, there is a, an Oriental population, but it's not, uh, certainly not a majority, nowhere near in China Grove, Texas. But uh, the song uh, is a wonderful song. They let off the World Gone Crazy uh, concert with China Grove. Why not? Here's China Grove. The Doobie Brothers on FreeGuitarMentor.com What I've been trying to do uh, successfully lately is, is spend a little time with strumming patterns. However, with this song, all the strums are down. The rhythm is important, but the, the, you know there's no worrying about you know two down, one up, all that kind of stuff. So I'm just going to go over slowly sort of that pattern for the intro. there I'm putting in some uh, muted hits and they I just it's something I do it's it, it's in there anyway and okay so let's move on to the chords you're going to need um, for China Grove Okay, we'll try and keep these uh, in the proper order as they appear in the song. You're going to need uh, an E major bar chord. And you may notice as I'm playing these chords that I have the, the amp overdriven, um, preamped somewhat for an overdriven sound. They're not smooth, clean country chords, they're, they're rock edge chords. <laughs> pointer finger down from the D note on the A string down to the D flat note. So I guess I would call this D flat over D. It's just it's a D, still a D bar chord with, with the pointer finger slid down to the fourth fret. So E, A major bar chord. back up to the D, to the E. You're going to need a C sharp minor bar chord, a B major bar chord, and you're going to need that A again and we're going to slide that up. I'm not going to call out all those chords because you're not really playing the full chord. You're just playing the the uh, arpeggio and uh, chorded arpeggio up. We're sliding up there from an A to a C chord. For the bridge portion of the song, you're going to need an A flat minor bar chord. A B major bar chord. This time. Played in with the A formation chord, but a B, B major, a C sharp minor bar chord, an F sharp minor bar chord, I'm going to go back to the C sharp minor, 
we're also going to need an F major, F sharp major bar chord. Not a minor, a major that one. And sequence again. And we're going to end up at A major. play a C, a C bar chord, D, D. Those are all the chords you need. Um, I am going to go through the song now, but I, I may stop or I may wait till the end to, to show you the little nuances of the song that kind of make it cool, like a... all that kind of stuff that they do. Okay, here's, uh, with the chords on the screen, here's China Grove. Before I begin, I should tell you that uh, when I play this in my band, I play with a delay, a delay on, with my pedal on delay, and it really does um, sound more like the original, so you can play around with that if you like. Um, if you have a delay, hook it up and have some fun with it. It does sound really good that way. That's how a verse goes. The second verse is going to be a repeat of that. Heading into the bridge portion of the song. takes you back into the intro. Now that is also the, uh, the intro to the guitar solo, which is played over top of a verse. Like so. Coming out of the guitar solo, End of song. Okay, let's go back and, and we'll uh, review a couple little things that were in there that uh, it's hard to slow down and show you while I'm playing. Okay, during the intro... You can do that. And that is 7th fret, using my first finger, 7th fret, 6th string, to ninth fret, sixth string with my third finger, and all I'm doing is using my first and third fingers, I end up on the fifth string, seventh fret as well. And that's just in, in, in between. A 
second time through, the bass actually plays plays that line. But uh, you can stick that in there if you like. Uh, another thing, coming out of the verse. And that's going into that part. I'm starting out on that uh, C sharp minor bar chord. And I can, all I'm doing is flattening out to make to make it as if it's a, a A formation chord, and that lifting that up and down, that's on the third string, actually tenth fret. I'm just hammering that down. Same thing with the major chord. into it. Well you talking about you Well you talking about you That little lick again. Talking about you child and grow oh, 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 oh. That part is actually done in harmony with another guitar. Oh, oh, oh child and grow Okay, a couple little bits that just add a little flavor to the song. Hope you enjoyed that. So that's uh, the Doobie Brothers, China Grove. We'll see you next time on freeguitarmentor.com.